is the mood in the camp so far? I think we were frustrated at the Sunderland game, the way we went 1-0 up and we couldn't keep that win. So it was kind of frustrating, but I think we got it out of the way on Monday, we had a good meeting. Everything we needed was in the air and today we have had a good training session, so the mood in the camp I think is all positive. I think that we know now that we need to graft in the next few games that we have and I think we all believe that we can stay up, it's whether we take that opportunity. You're having a hell of a season really at the Bells, aren't you? How have you felt? How are you settling in? I think as soon as my first session, I really, I settled in straight away. I think that's to do with the staff and the, the girls, so I've just been playing with confidence and that, that's been shown really and I've happily got my first goal, hopefully many more to come. How did it feel to score your first goal? I think it was a proud moment for me, definitely on a personal level, but to get the goal for the girls, it was some time coming and hopefully we can get more in other games, it was just doing it for the team really. And not bad that you were at the back post as yeah, well. Did you bad. do you find yourself in those positions often? Or? Um, sometimes here and there. <laughs> Depends really what game. We've got Reading just around the corner. Just yeah. how big a game would you say that is? Uh, I think it's a derby game by far. I mean, even me coming in, I know that I'll want to do 110% for the girls, and the girls know that. I mean, I think we're going to fight for that win both games that we play against them. So it's going to be pretty much cup final every game and I know we'll put it in. Final word for the fans as well, because they've obviously been there yeah. through thick and thin. I'm, yes. I'm sure you've heard them from By the far, yeah. from the stands. How how good is that as a player to sort of hear hear them cheering you on it, everywhere? It's like that 12th man that you need on the pitch, and I'll, I'll always hear them, always hear the bells, so, and how welcoming they've been for me. So they've been a big part 